What is this? Wait, wait. You know what this reminds me of actually? Will Wilco 404. That's him. So he changes at. Um But this is this is him right here. Where we, we met this dude at a schoolie concert and he was taking pictures at the concert. Damn, the pictures are gone. We did a little photo shoot with him one time and he was like, oh yeah, I could teach you guys how to take photos, but you gotta pay me hourly. And I'm like, what the fuck? Who does that shit? Who brings people along to photo shoots and then makes the photographer pay hourly to do labor for you? Such a fucked up industry. Wait, oh, you know what happened with this? This dude, um, he took this picture at Buck, uh, uh, on this bridge at Buckhead and we we're like, oh, Bro, where's this picture at? Uh, Faze DM'd him, he's like, where's this picture at? Where, where'd you take it at? So we went to the same location. This is shortly after we got our A6500, not 6400. We got the A6500 and we're like, damn bro, Sony, low light game. You know, they're really out here changing the game. And this is when the A6500 first came out. A thousand something dollars, thousand two hundred, thousand three hundred, something like that is what we paid for it. Oh wait, no, he deleted it. He had a picture of, of FaZe had a picture of himself on the bridge that looked way better. And it was like proof. It was like, bro, you put me and FaZe in the same situation as these other photographers, as these quote unquote photographers who are out here like, oh, I charge this much per hour just to teach you, just to bring you along. Look at the garbage photos that this guy's taking. And this guy gets paid for photo shoots and he gets invited to all this shit. These people are hiring the wrong people. Cause it's like, you look at this compared to, I don't have the picture of FaZe, but I have this picture of Sham that we got over there a, a couple weeks later. Look at this. This is in the same location. There's this and there's this. Which looks better to you? Which looks like it has more of an aesthetic. Now, to be fair, I was going for a lot more blooming. I did cut out quite a lot of detail here. I cut out a lot. I added this one, as you can see that A in the background. Um, that one's not subtle. I was, I was supposed to make it smaller, but I, I wish I like cut it off. I wish I put it right there, but there's a lot more brightness coming into this picture, right? It kind of hurts the eyes to look at this, but that's kind of what I was going for is the blooming is this like a lot of fantasy look like I, I tend to over edit this sort of thing. But like, look at how, compared to this, look at how like fucking boring and bland and generic. Look at me just like standing. What kind of dumb shit is this? Like, it blows my mind how like, people like this get calls. Hey, come take my pictures, come take my pictures. Just because they do marketing. But it's like people like me and Face who are genuinely able to take good pictures. And that wasn't like, this is an ugly picture by the way. This is actually an ugly picture, but it's much better than what this guy can do. Honestly, the way I would edit photos is I just wanted to see how far they could be taken for editing. I just wanted to push them to their limits basically without a flash, you know, just with night light. Thank you Sony for allowing me to do that. But like these people are literally hiring the wrong people. Like they're actually stupid. Like I don't, I don't usually like show off anything because I know my place. I know I'm not like a, you know, exceptional photographer or whatever, but compared to the photographers that everybody else like hires, I'm so much better. And then Phases actually does this shit, you know? Uh, and he was taking pictures of the Schoolie concert. It was Schoolie's first ever concert, ever. And we were there in the crowd, but he was going up on stage. He was just ahead of us. And it's been years since then. It's been years since that, that, that concert. Where has William gotten? Marginally more followers in this saturated market of like, a hundred thousand different Instagram photographer entrepreneurs doing the same exact thing, nothing special. Like remember when Will took that picture of you? Yeah. How much did you weigh around this time? Okay, like 150. This Will shoot right here, Co 404. I'm on this dude's Instagram. Wait. Who? Wait, who? You remember that uh, the dude that Will, the guy who shot that picture? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, I'm not. I'm looking for his Instagram. What is it? I think he deleted it. No way. Probably for temporary because you know people delete their shit randomly. Bro, but he had that picture on like the Buckhead Bridge. And then there oh, was. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Easy. And then there was. And then there. Like his picture was so garbage compared to ours. Yeah, dude. Ours, ours was so much better. Why the hell didn't he like see the opportunity to get all these lights in there and stuff? Yeah, dude, these fucking... Yeah, this bridge right here, dude, I was just better. Dude, you, like, manipulate the lights. It's, it's co underscore 404, right? 
Yeah. Wait, is that still on my pro my profile? I'm not sure. Okay, I don't think so. I don't think so either. Yeah, I delete a lot of my pics because I just look young as shit in them, bro. Did you delete them or archive them? I archived them. Okay, good, good, good. Because you got to save that shit. Because I did not yeah. screenshot all of them, bro, and we got to have them. Facts. Yeah, he deleted his Instagram, I think. I still yeah, have, he did. Um, I still have a screenshot from his Instagram of this right here, which was, we did that, we took that picture. Oh, yeah, we took those. Bro, you know, I think I look back on it. I've never taken a single rolling shot photo. Oh, yeah, rolling is hard, bro. Because, because like, I always think I have because of how many rolling shot photos we did. But I look back on it. It was always me driving. I've literally never taken one. Yeah, because they're like, I couldn't drive back yeah. then. <laughs> I literally couldn't fucking drive. 